do not repeat the same mistake the adam and eve did by not trusting in god genesis 3:15 i have asked you repeatedly that god made adam and eve sinless and you failed where does it say in scripture that god is changing his plan genesis 3:15 i will put enmities between you and woman between your offspring and her offspring she will crush your head and you will lie in wait for her heels in latin translated saint jeremiah it use the latin word ipsa for the genesis 3:15 c in this human body some theologians say that it was one further and it was one more even more and that is the blessed mother so not only are you going to worship god man united but i am going to elevate not a divinity but a pure human in a natural body above you as my mother and she will be called the queen of all the angels So ah oh, what the heck I can understand worshiping divinity and honoring and serving divinity I'm not going to honor and serve a human pure human above me I'm the most brilliant of all creation and this would kind of go along with the idea that who did Satan tempt first in the garden he went to the woman oh is this the woman that you're going to put above me I'll show you about this woman So that's a possibility there. But we know for a fact that Satan hates Mary even if that's not the case because the incarnation. Everything was going smoothly until she said yes because once Jesus came on the scene, it was over. He's not going to fail. He's God. He's going to get his agenda completed whether Satan likes it or not. So there are three instances of the angels. The first instance is their creation. The second instance was their probation. So they were given a certain knowledge and they didn't have to say, "Well, let me see." all eternity well, I don't this fire no oh, I don't know about that they didn't have to think about it they knew exactly what the circumstances were and some said no thanks and then michael said who is like unto god and they were cast into hell so that was their test so our probation is our entire life i have my entire life i don't know when i'm going to die but to make my choice and only after i die is my choice final well the angels don't need a lifetime to figure it out the angels knew it instantaneously and so they made their choice that they can't go back on it and so the third act of the angels is now either eternity in hell or eternal beatitude so our angels now are in that third instance where they are actually in the beatific vision experiencing the glory the majesty the overwhelming joy the overwhelming just beatitude of what heaven is that we have no way of expressing in human terms but the devils they were cast out of wherever this probationary period was and they are suffering the fires of hell but they suffer it kind of like a cloud that goes with them everywhere so they are roaming around the world roaming throughout the earth seeking to devour souls seeking to bring about their ruin so i said that their other sin besides pride was envy envy at what envy at you and envy at me so their number one desire their number one goal is to get us to burn in hell for eternity with them we're going to talk about the ordinary activity of devils devil is not yet humiliated yet until souls are protected under the protection of holy mary mother of god genesis 3:15 3:15 she crushed the head of serpent jesus and holy mary mother of god both crushed the head of serpent if you listen to god genesis 3:15 the god which is jesus in human flesh Jesus said in the cross behold your mother This world ruled by Satan because you love sin here is the cure of sin holy rosary prayer to our holy mother mary mother of god she protect you from sin you will not fall in sin not even faded it's a promise to god genesis 3:15 Genesis 3:15 Our Lord thy God Jesus said behold your mother